Police tell us they're investigating a stabbing where one man is dead, two other people are hurt. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bianca Holman. And I'm Don Roberts. Tenio Sides Haley Mylon live at the scene right now in Hampton. Haley, what can you tell us? Well, I can tell you that Corporal Ernie Williams of the Hampton Police Division confirmed to me earlier this morning that one man is dead. He died of blunt force trauma to his head. Two other people are injured in. Uh, it started as a domestic incident. It led to a triple stabbing. An adult male and an adult female both have non life threatening injuries. The woman is being treated at an area hospital. Let me step away so that you can see this scene. We're looking at the blue house at the end of the cul de sac there. So the two other people are expected to survive, although an ambulance just pulled up on scene. I'll work to figure out what is going on there. Police just put the crime tape up a couple hours ago, about an hour after the incident, and I've seen investigators knocking on doors and talking to neighbors throughout the morning. Now, Williams told me there was no confrontation with police when they arrived at the home. I'm told all the parties are cooperating with the investigation and so far no criminal charges have been announced. This happened on Winder Court near the Big Bethel Road and Briarfield Road and it looks like family and friends have been um, have been rotating in and speaking with investigators throughout the morning and of course we'll be here on the scene working to learn more about what led to this incident. Right now there's no reason to believe that there's any threat um, or potential harm to the public here. But of course, we'll have updates throughout the day for you. Live in Hampton, I'm Haley Mylon, 10 on your side. Haley, thank you.